All right, I'm just waiting on my lunch over here to heat up so I can have it to eat. And I thought I'd share with this with you. And this is a bowl that I've been testing for a little while. It is from Keith Titanium. It is a double wall bowl, which has the advantages of not only keeping the contents warm, but keeping too much heat from transferring so that it's not too hot to hold on to. So yeah, it it's, comes in very lightweight at 4.1 ounces, 115 grams. So, you know, very, very light. Does come with a stuff sack, of course. The volume for this is 550 milliliters or 18.6 ounces. You know, just a really nice size bowl for your lunch. Works exactly as advertised. Keith makes top quality products without doubt. I've reviewed a number of them on my channel. I have a playlist for Keith Titanium. I know some of them are kind of expensive, but sometimes quality does costs. But this isn't too bad at all, and it really does work well. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is just put my lunch together now. I'll eat my lunch and I'll give you a few closing thoughts on this. Guess I wasn't paying close enough attention to my lunch. It got warm enough that I actually had a boil over on the sides, but uh, uh, nothing stuck to the pot, which is what I was just concerned about here. All right, let me pour that into the bowl. If you're interested, this is another one of my test recipes for the herbs worst. And uh, I'll leave it at that. If you're interested, uh, just look up the term herbs worst. I haven't perfected the recipe enough yet to bring it to you uh, as a video, but I will at some point, of course. All right, I hope this is showing up here, the steam coming off of this bowl of hot soup. Very hot soup, but the bowl itself is nice and cool to the touch. Too hot to eat just yet. I think I'll put that down. Give it a few minutes to cool off before I enjoy it. In fact, that was one of the comments I was going to make about this, is that it does not come with a cover. And I felt that a cover would be useful for it for a couple of things. If this was winter time, then of course it would keep my soup or whatever I have in the bowl warm that much longer. I don't need it for that reason during the summer, but there is a secondary reason for it, and that is to keep things out of my soup. So. We're in a forest, right? Pine needles, or pine trees all around me. I find often I'll find pine needles in my meals because they just fall off the tree at a regular constant base as well as, I don't know if you can see the black flies that are around me. I don't want those in my meal. So a lid of some type would be great. So what I tried at home and works well enough for this, I didn't bring it out because it wasn't quite the right size. I've actually just ordered one, is a silicone lid. You can buy silicone lids off of Amazon or AliExpress or just circular lids that have a little knob in the center that you can put over bowls for microwaving or whatever else, but they're ideal for use with this. Very lightweight, very heat resistant, will keep your uh, contents warm in the winter time, keep the bugs and the needles out of them during the summertime. So I will be adding one of those to this bowl kit, and I think it's a great addition if you decide you want to buy one. Okay, simple video, simple product, highly effective. The idea of a double wall titanium bowl that keeps the contents warm, keeps your hands cool, but uh, is still very lightweight. What a great idea, right? I really like this bowl, and I, I'm gonna, you're gonna see it in more videos for obvious reasons that it's just such a good bowl to take with you. All right, as I mentioned, I'll put the links in the video description as well as the specifications for this. If you have any comments or questions around the bowl, uh, then by all means, put those in the comments section. But until next time, get out and explore and take that path less travel because it will make all the difference. Bye for now.